Yo, what is up everyone? Welcome to Soccer Source HQ. I'm your host, Christian Soler, also your sports reporter for everything soccer in Southern California. It's August 30th, 2022, and I am in Cerritos, California for this first junior college game of the season. The home team, Cerritos College, representing the white and blue jerseys, are taking on the visiting squad from Imperial College in black and white. Cerritos on the attack the entire game today, and the first goal comes in the 14th minute with this graceful pass from the captain, Pablo Caparelli, with the assist to number 16, Antonio Negrete, the sophomore from Bosco, as he skillfully puts it away upper right V. Negrete again in the first half, just two minutes later with just a rocket of a shot and the best one of the best goals I've seen this year. And he deserves the man of the match because of that. Two goals for him. Kudos to you, kid, for doing such a great job. But Belchamp for Imperial, just three saves in a matter of 36, 30 seconds inside the six-yard box. Another person who deserves the man of the match today, even though his team lost. He is just on fire and just being tested constantly all game today. Beltran, another save for him in the first half. And Cerritos hits the post here in the second half. And again, Cerritos on the attack, but there he is, Beltran to make that save over and over and over again. As you see, Beltran is right here in the second half too, just stuffing as many shots as he can in the second half. But Beltran is no superhero. He can only do so much because the third goal comes to Cerritos from number 20, Kobe Chavez, and the assist from number 15, Brian Saldana, the freshman. The best opportunity for Imperial to score in the second half comes here from number 13, the sophomore defender with the attack and just getting stuff from Camacho, the Cerritos goalkeeper. Cerritos on the attack in the second half and a shot from inside the 18 coming from the low left. And Beltran is there over and over again. And of course, here's Beltran again, just denying that header going past his line. One more opportunity for Imperial to score in the second half with a nice through ball to number 10, Hugo Mendoza, who just crashes down the box and takes a shot, but it goes directly into the chest of the Cerritos goalkeeper. And Beltran here, he is again, just doing everything that he can to make the score just so low for his team. Just such a phenomenal goalie. Great job for you, Beltran. Kudos for all your saves today. But Christopher Corona, the little guy, number 21, just so gracefully, skillfully likes to dance inside that box as he takes on two defenders. And that's it. That's the final score. Cerritos College take this game with the final score of 4-0. to zero. Make sure you subscribe to this channel, share this with all your friends, and I will see everybody in the next one. Cheers.